I think any time, whether we're postmodernist, and Rush Rankin, I guess, likes to call me that, and he's very much more up on criticism lately, the criterion is whether it's quality. And that's, that's a bad word to use around a lot of people, as it seems to be, again, outside of the regular discourse. Outside of, outside of its political content, outside of its propaganda value, outside of its advertising content, whether it can make money or not. That's, uh, and it has sometimes, it's divorced from the luck of uh, publicity, luck of showing and so on. And what is quality? Quality is evidence of respect for living things. It's respect for materials, respect for the self. It's evidence of self-confidence. It's evidence of intellectual curiosity. And it's also evidence of uh, frugal use of capital. And it's also evidence of a uh, sense of community need. These are things that I talk about in the syllabus of foundation because I have to. If somebody wants to know what, you can't just say what is quality. And you know, the people before me have formed it into those cloud diagrams. And uh, you learn it by doing, being active with it. You don't learn it by having an idea and then prosecuting that idea or getting somebody else to prosecute that idea. That's, that's so anti to the ethos here. And uh, that's, that's an end. That's, that's what a, a dilettante would do. Many times they would come and say, oh, these students are so good at making things. I wish I could make things as well as them, but I have good ideas. So maybe I should give them some good ideas, and then they would do them. And that's, that's not how it works. My friend Paula Wintner made a painting of uh, Abraham sac sacrificing Isaac. An arrogant young fellow named Peter Alden said, uh, you know, you're a really good painter, but I have really good ideas. We should collaborate. And she said some, he said something further about something in the painting. And, uh, so for Christmas, she, she's Jewish, but she cut up, she cut up the painting. Uh, she didn't like much of the painting. All she gave him, she kept the angel with the sheep. And she gave him the rest of the painting with this, this, this corner cut out of it, with this like patriarchal man about to stab an un, undifferentiated gender Isaac. And he saw that, and he just like ran out of the room. So you cut God out of the picture. <laughs> but what it really we didn't know is that he had just broken up with a, a young woman who looked very much like the depiction of Isaac. And in the, in the breakup letters, he'd written about uh, cutting her. <laughs> so he was like, you read my mind. It's terrifying. But the excuse was that he, she had cut out God from the picture. Oh With, you know, she's the person doing the painting, not him. Mm -hmm. And it's her. she's capable of having the ideas. <laughs>